Got to learn CPR for my job every year. I have to take a CPR class every summer, which I thought was excessive. I complained just a little bit. I was like, okay, um, are there really big medical advancements in CPR every year? <laughs> it turns out there are important changes that happen all the time. I don't know if you guys know that. Important changes that happen all the time. Like, did you know this? No more mouth stuff. Did you guys know that? No more mouth stuff, which is like, what's in it for me now? <laughs> Why am I even? <laughs> Only chest compressions, because you got to get blood to the brain. Within three minutes, the person will die. Then I complained about that, because I was like, oh, I will mess that up. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm going to mess that up, for sure. And the guy goes, no, you won't, because I have a trick. You do the chest compressions, the beat of the song. Staying alive. Staying alive. <laughs> I was like, what? He goes, yeah, you just go, uh, 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 staying alive, staying alive. I was like, that's a pretty good idea. <laughs> what he didn't tell us, and I think this is super important, is to not sing it out loud while you're doing it. Because <laughs> you look like a real jerk at minute four. <laughs> you're still bobbing your head singing Staying Alive to a dead dude, you know what I mean? I feel like that's a bad move. And I told him that, he goes, it also works to another one bites the dust. Don't put that in my head, are you kidding me? I'm an idiot. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> I lied a little bit, I fibbed just a little bit, just a little bit. Uh, I quit teaching full-time to do stand-up comedy full-time and uh, Thank you for your support, and you guys are like, ah, oh, oh, oh. seems like a bad move, buddy. <laughs> but I still substitute teach. I taught for 12 years full time, and now I substitute teach, which is way better and way easier, because I'm not trying to make a difference anymore. <laughs> I'm just trying to get through the day and catch up on Gilmore Girls on Netflix. Like, that's a good day. Make sure no kids eat peanuts. Like, that's a good day as a sub, right? I chose Gilmore Girls, one, because it's true, and two, because I looked it up. Utah, only state in America where that's the most watched Netflix show. <laughs> Which I think was very sweet and funny, because every other state is like scandalous stuff, like making a murderer, or like House of Cards, or like actual scandal. <laughs> But I just like that Utah was like, nope, the most scandalous we get is a single mother from Connecticut. <laughs> That's the best <laughs> we can do. Subscribe to Dry Bar Comedy for even more of the world's largest collection of clean comedy.